Hi there, just a quick uh, video about the Phantom 2 Vision. This is uh, the box. It's a little bit wider than the old box. There's a reason for that. It's because, unlike the old one where you had to assemble, uh, do a little bit of assembly, you had to attach these feet, you had to attach the compass, you had to attach the radio control antenna here, uh, etc. And if you were mounting a camera, you'd have to mount that yourself um, that you'd have bought separately. Um, this comes, as you see it basically, the only thing I've done to this out of the box is put these stickers on. So you have a choice of blue, pink or red. And I've put the propellers on. That's it. The camera's all pre-installed. It's on this mount. It's all connected. Um, the, the legs are on. Everything like that. Um, new feature of the legs. Have these new little black pads which uh, on a slippery surface stop it. Uh, sliding around which is quite nice. Um, the propellers are new as well, new design and also um, they've got captive nuts inside them and they will only go on the right arms. You'll see you've got silver ones on these two and black on these two and they can only go um, on the correct arms so they're, they're threaded um, the right way. So if you tried to put that on there it just wouldn't go on which is excellent, stops people making a mistake and causing their phantom to flip. Um, camera has comes with a lens cap. It's a high definition camera, 1920 by 1080. Uh, the back of the camera you can see off, cam on, Wi-Fi on switch and a micro SD slot. Um, micro SD isn't supplied, you need to uh, purchase one of those separately. Um, you know, we've just seen in there a nice close-up of the battery compartment that's new um, you've got these two contacts actually four contacts um, two big contacts for the battery uh, and that's because we've got a new entirely new battery it's a new specific phantom battery which has a little nice feature that you can see how much charge you've got without putting a multimeter on it or whatever very nice. This is actually 4400 milliamp hours as you can see, but the, this is a pre-production sample. The real Phantom will be 5200. Now at 4400 it's already double what the old Phantom was. So we're getting um, flight times of about 22 to, to 25 minutes, possibly up to 30 minutes with the, uh, with the final version. So that's really excellent. And that just uh, slots in there and plugs in. I won't do it in case it fires up. Uh, it's just got two tabs there to release it. Uh, On to the transmitter side of things. This is the transmitter. So I've got my Android phone attached to it, which uh, works perfectly well. It doesn't need iPhone. Um, and the way this works, you have this Wi-Fi uh, range extender, they call it. It's basically a little repeater station. And the phone connects to the range extender and then the range extender connects to the Phantom itself. You see it's just a power switch on there there um, and it charges off a micro USB. Um, the actual radio control to the Phantom is 5.8 gigahertz. Uh, in the software itself you can see we've got an artificial horizon bottom left we've got these two controls tilt the camera up and down the that button tilts the camera but based on your uh, accelerometer in your in your phone the um, this button here takes a still this one starts the video recording that one tells you you've got a micro SD in that one tells you how many satellites you've got or how many satellites the Phantom's got rather um, that one tells you the Wi-Fi is on and the signal strength and that's the battery condition. You've got more information at the bottom as well, your altitude, speed, distance, etc. Um, yeah, very impressive piece of kit and uh, I'll do a, another video shortly with some flight video. Um, just one thing, one more thing, this um, quick start guide is quite good, it tells you, shows you what all the LED status lights mean so you don't have to carry the manual around with you. Oh and one other thing, the um, the lights on the front of the battery, although this is the power switch for the Phantom, they don't actually give you the status of the Phantom. Um, 
instead of the old phantom, phantom LED, status LED on the old phantom, you now use these two two leg lights, um, arm lights, tell you the status. So they'll be flashing different colours. The t two front ones are always red, and the two back ones are your status indicators. Yeah, excellent piece of kit. Um, available on firstpersonview.co.uk now. Thank you.